I'm cackling. She started to gag as soon as she came in here. What's up, y'all? Before we get into today's shenanigans, let me just tell you about Instant Gaming. Instant Gaming is a website that allows you to get all of your favorite games at a discounted price. Whether you play on PC like me or console, they have something for you over at Instant Gaming. Y'all know how pricey The Sims can get with all these kits, expansion packs, game packs. I wish I knew about Instant Gaming when I first started buying all of these packs. I would have saved so much coin. They even have growing together at a discounted price. You know how much I pay for that? $40. So listen, save your coin and go ahead and use the link in the description box to get your games at a discounted price. Let's get into the video. What's up everybody? Welcome back to the channel. If you are new here, hi, welcome. My name is Monica, Moni for short. And today we're doing something a little different. We are here with Alexis instead of Amari. So y'all, I really don't know what this is right now. I've just been really enjoying playing with my side characters of my main LP series. Like I played with Shaylin and Sassy from my Indian Kill All My series and now I'm I'm playing with Alexis from my grown together single mother and single father. I don't know like my characters be doing their own thing like behind the screens like when I'm not in the game they be doing their own thing. So I was like hmm their stories are a little interesting as well. So I kind of wanted to do something different. It's not fully fleshed out yet but I know what direction I kind of want to go in like I kind of want to give you guys like little episodes in between bigger episodes where like I don't got to do like the Machinima intro and all of that and we can just get into gameplay and do something real fun and cute and simple just to get you guys more content and for me to have fun because I'm actually really having fun with these series and their background characters because they are just that they are characters so this is Alexis for those who don't know Alexis is about 23 is the sister of Amari the bro who is a main character in my growing together single mother LP and and Alexis is just sitting here. She realized she missed her period, which wouldn't be a big thing. But in Amari series, Alexis found out she was pregnant by someone she's talking to. She's not even really in a real relationship with this guy, but she really, really likes him. She really, really cares about him. And his name is Kendall. Kendall is the brother of Casey who is the main star in my growing together single father LP. If this is your first time watching I know it feels like a lot. Basically two people go together and the brother and the sister like each other. That's it. It sounds real convoluted but I promise it's not. You don't have to watch either LP to get into what's going on here today. So just know that my sister was pregnant in another series. She went through with getting the pregnancy terminated and now she's like damn him you know she went back to her old ways let's be clear she went back to Kendall you know kept doing what they were doing they didn't care and now my sis is just sending to herself like my flow app was like hey did you log your period you're a little late sis so she's just pondering to herself like you know maybe I should take a pregnancy test and that is exactly what we're gonna do today we are in her childhood bedroom I'm gonna spare you guys a tour today but I'll just give you a little overview of of Alexis's room she still lives at home with her parents and her brother a lot of times she goes and stays with her sister her mother cheated on her father and things have just been real tense around the house so we're gonna have our girl come in here and take a pregnancy test you know just out of precaution I'm gonna give my sis a little privacy damn she had to change her outfit to um you put on the Chanel to take the pregnancy test oh girl she's leaned over y'all already know what that means hold on wait this is how we starting off the little mini LPs y'all I, I want to say they're like backstories like LP backstories a mini LP a LP inside of LP my sis is bent over already y'all hold on let's get the let's get the shot y'all know I need me a shot hold on y'all know I need me a thumbnail let's 
let's get it let's get it together y'all hold on if you guys follow me on twitch y'all already know what's going on big baby is pregnant alexis is pregnant there's gonna be a new addition to this household so honestly who's alexis texting oh she's texting kendall like listen i think we need to talk i just took a test and i need to come over there and talk to you but sis are you gonna wash your hands like you just peed on the stick like i'm not saying you peed on your hands but it would just be very hygienic if you just washed your hands so yeah alexis is feeling very energized but let me see how she feels about this baby oh lord so she like my sister is ice grilling she is not happy about this pregnancy at all but at least she's serving so it says unwanted child on the way from woohoo alexis did not expect to have a child and is not really sure she wants it at all my thing is you let in that man shoot up your club and you talking about you're not expecting to have a child okay but it's happening what should she do so usually i would give my sis a little bit of slack but she just was in this situation like no we're gonna go to our appointment later like my sis is in despair she's like i can't believe this happens again like i can't tell amari amari's gonna be pissed at me amari is the older sister and you know how older sisters can be they think they know every damn thing so it also has have not forgotten alexis's mind goes back to the recent pregnancy experience or debacle on its own accord so sis is just thinking like i can't believe i got myself in this ish again so listen we're getting to the bottom of this let me have her ask uh not call to harass her ex she She's gonna ask can i come over to kendall not amari child and not casey the dad is coming over here he's probably venting about the mom of course you can come over travel to 19 cold pepper house okay okay so this is odd right because all of the times that alexis has kicked it with kendall they have always kicked it at like casey's house like casey has like a little mini mansion so she's like hmm, this is a different address that i'm used to he lives in san Machuno. she lives in willow creek she's a real suburban girl so she's like you know um I guess I can go meet you in the city. So we're gonna go meet Kendall in the city and see where he lives. Y'all look at them. They kind of match. Okay, wait, this is kind of cute. They kind of match. Like this is a very dysfunctional couple. Just letting y'all know off the rip if y'all don't watch either LP. But listen, they kind of eating. Let's take a picture real quick before we go into this apartment job because we really don't know what to expect. Okay, girl, you like photography. Excellent. Let's take a few quick pics. Like Kendall doesn't even know like, like, y'all are about to be parents oh these are cute honestly it's so weird because they look like omari and casey they look like their brother and sister in these pictures okay this is kind of cute okay let's, let's do another one. Oh, oh wait y'all are eating these pictures up oh yes oh okay the parents they don't even know oh how about that be their little lp name for referral the parents so yeah let's go ahead and go to kendall's apartment i want to know why he met us outside like he's like listen and i'm just gonna warn you before you go in my spot like it, it, we, we got some stuff going on now she learned he's non-committal baby we have a baby on the way hello like you ain't know this man was non-committal before he laid you down this is the second time getting you pregnant girl like let's get into it i'm gonna have them go ahead and go into kendall's apartment let me give you guys a tour of his bachelor pad so we decorated it if you want to call it this on twitch y'all this is kendall's little bachelor pad he got a bar over here though for the ladies a humidifier because you know it smell crazy in here he got a little uh friend you know we got in-home pets we got a little chair over here you know if you want uh to come sit down we got the box tv this is his mother's old tv that she gave him just like this is her old couch she was like you moving out on your own you can have my old furniture then we have a little room over here because listen just because we living like this don't mean we don't have a crazy ass sneaker collection a lot of these he stole from kc a lot of these he just stole and then let's go over here to the bedroom where the magic happens actually alexis did not lay down over here yet we got the tv on the floor clothes on the floor towel candle another little uh pet over here we're very animal friendly and then we got our little setup over here he be streaming y'all and the air mattress deluxe blue and plaid for the ladies pleasure and we got a little we got a little balcony out here hold on we got a nice view like not for nothing kendall has a nice view y'all y'all can't lie like the apartment is kind of jacked but like the view is nice like imagine a nice romantic kiss with your babes on the balcony like this so alexis is about to come in here for the 
for the first time. Not that Kiki in the hallway. They don't want to go take it inside. He's really trying to keep her from going here. So let's go here together. He's really trying to entertain us outside, but we have some real news we want to tell you. She's like, listen, I don't want to tell you this in the hallway. This is kind of a, a private matter. So y'all look at Alexis's traits. She's a foodie. She's a perfectionist. She's ambitious. She's materialistic. She's a snob. And yeah, oh, where my girl get anemic? She does not want children right now. Why does it say my sis is sinister? Sinister sims are always up to no good trying to achieve their goals no matter the consequences. Sis, who you backstabbed? But yeah, Kendall's like, this is it. This is my place. And Alexis like, I know you are effing lying to me, okay? She's like, oh, y'all, wait, I'm cackling. She started to gag as soon as she came in here she's like girl what the f is this she said baby you got that trash by the door like it smells crazy in here and he's just like yeah this is where i call home this why be a kc house girl you ain't know she's looking at him like you're dead ass living like this like i'm not used to this y'all know alexis guys a nice ass house okay so she's like girl what the hell is going on in here so let's just tell him right off the bat where's he trying to dip to did he go to the this man went to the bed. He's trying to go to sleep on the air mattress. No, sir. Uh, I'm gonna have to control him because this is crazy. No, sir. We're controlling you. You're not going to bed. He's feeling very playful. Intense itching crab lice. Oh no, Kendall contracted crab lice. The intense itching caused by little bugs living around his genitalia is not going to clear out without proper treatment. Girl! And this is who she picked to be her baby daddy. Did you get them crab lice from Jay? Because you ain't get that from us. Hello? Wait, Alexis come here she's ready to chat to him she's like yo i really need to talk to you and you're trying to go to sleep let me uh hold on wait is it no lights in here can we turn on the lights is it only lights out here okay well can we go here together let me control him can we uh, let's go here together y'all i need a screenshot of when she tells you this but also y'all um alexis is not innocent in this she got another little boo jamal so jamal and kendall are actually kind of like friends i mean i guess they they have one friend in common casey is jamal's best friend and casey is kendall's brother so yeah girl it, it, it's a lot everybody's like intertwined in this messy save file so um yeah yeah, let's ask him actually let's ask him we're gonna ask kendall like hey i know what happened last time and i never really asked you but do you want kids yo she's sitting on a milk crate you got my girl sitting over here on the milk crate this is how she has to tell you 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 know like what's going on let's see what he says i'd be all right with having a child i'll also be all right with not having a child so you're neutral well that's great because i got some news for you buddy go ahead and share that pregnancy news my girl oh does she have the crab lights too oh we're pregnant and got crabs he gave us crabs and a baby what girl what what Alexis is experiencing an intense itching sensation around her genitals. Could this be something serious? You gave my girl crabs and a baby. Oh no. He's looking like, girl, I know that ain't what I think it is. And she's like, yes, a damn pregnancy test. And your ass gave me crabs. Like, what's going on? Okay, wait. This shit is doomed before it began. Like, she's like, look. I am pregnant y'all she is not having it she is nervous she's like I don't want to be pregnant with your baby you didn't gave me lice you didn't gave me lice cubic lice at that girl why he look happy what the hell she do not want to be pregnant she's like girl I, I don't want to have this baby he's like it's gonna be okay you know we can get rid of the crabs you know let, let's just talk about this so oh Oh, now she mad. Yeah, actually, let's cuss him out, actually, because why did he give us crabs? She's like, yo, are you dead for real? Oh, my sis is crying. Ask him about... Wait, why did everything go away? Where is he going? He's going to use the bathroom. Um, I think not, sir. I had a whole bunch of stuff lined up, and it all disappeared. So I'm about to cuss him out. So yeah, my sister hot. She about to ask him about WTDs and discuss hopelessness from baby and share worries about pregnancy. She like, listen, what are we going to do with the baby for real? Like, this is how you live? You live like this? 
Where's my baby gonna go? I, I, I can't do this. She's gonna discuss possibly terminating a baby. Oh, let's see. What's he saying? I don't know. Oh, she's very tense now though. Maybe he didn't go for it. Let me read this little moodlet. So it says not exactly in agreement. Wait, girl, I'm trying to read your moodlet. Hold on, calm down. Not exactly in agreement. Alexis's partner took the news of the pregnancy more positively than herself. They're not unreasonably happy, but they still don't seem to really understand how Alexis feels about this. He's like, listen, like you don't want to have no baby. Stop telling me take the rubber off. How about that? So let's see what he says. Okay, that's that crab lice. He has to pee okay and then it says pregnancy uncertainty kendall is open to the idea of having children so he is fine with the news of his partner's pregnancy it is even a little exciting but his partner is distraught and freaking out they don't want this baby kendall is not sure what to say or do but yeah girl i mean he's just gonna be like you know maybe you should just spend the night oh she's mugging he's like it's late you should spend the night oh wait of course I'll be there for you, honey. So she's like, if I do have this, would you be there for me? Oh, she's just cussing him out at this point. She cussing him out. He got to pee. Um, let me actually help y'all out. You go pee. And Alexis is like, um, you know what? I'm just going to go grab some, some medication. Let me have my sis go over here and, oh, wait, she can't grab none. Oh, I don't think we can go to the Wicked store. Can he go to the Wicked store? We're going to have him go to the Wicked store. Go ahead and pee and then go to the, look at you. You want to goof around. Like, this is why. This is who you have. You know, I was about to talk about him, but you laughing at the jokes like, girl, this is exactly why he's a clown and you want to be a part of the circus. So I, I, I can't, you know, I can't vouch for either one of y'all, but let me just read y'all Kendall's traits. So Kendall is childish. He's self-assured, non-committal, a Gemini and outgoing. So yeah, now he got a weak immune system. Oh Lord, Kendall, help. But yeah, so Kendall has a lot of growing up to do. As you guys can see, oh, she just out here cussing. Like my girl is mad. Them boobs is already sticking out. Like my sis is fed up. Is she about to eat? like what's going on ew i would not eat here but she's pregnant so she's eating a ham sandwich she is pissed she's like i guess i'll spend the night here but i don't want to it stink over here oh she's happy though she's feeling great from having high needs she feels a close connection with kendall it feels great to spend time oh hold on it's great to spend time with someone who alexis feels a deep connection someone lives here from being in a dusty area girl of course somebody live here oh she's nauseated the old stomach isn't feeling too good so every time she's gonna eat here she's probably gonna get nauseous and she's a foodie and you're pregnant girl so like why would you eat here you see this fridge why would you eat from a fridge that looks like like that that's the real issue so kendall is out getting them some some crab shampoo she over here trying to clean up like is there anything we can do i'm just glad that the uh the mice been laying low mice been laying low my sister you know she she's nauseous from this damn baby now she about to watch tv watch cooking shows for ideas girl you don't want to go to bed i feel you i wouldn't even want to let the shower curtain touch me in this bed okay so kendall's kendall is here where he going okay kendall like hey i got that thing you know um let's give her a gift let me see can i okay can y'all shower together you know yeah let's shower with alexis he's like hey you know um you want to get rid of your crabs together and she's like yeah okay oh now she looks sad oh girl i know you was in a hell of a situation let me see if i can even do it though oh it's not letting me use the crab medication so they showering together for no reason girl okay i forgot to show y'all i'll give y'all a tour this is the bathroom hold on i forgot to show y'all the bathroom there's nothing to write home about but yeah this is probably the cleanest place like at least he keep the bathroom clean you know i'll give kendall that she in the damn shower washing his locks are y'all in love just let me know like what's going on i feel like y'all are both a very unlikely couple so okay he i'm gonna have him fix her some breakfast because he cares so he's gonna get her you know some eggs and toast at least he, he look like he got a little bit of groceries in there hold on no more itching hallelujah but yeah he's cooking her some breakfast because he cares it's five o'clock i'll probably let my sis get a quick little siesta over here come take a nap in your man's air mattress she's very tense this pregnancy is really irritating her twice the shower thoughts sharing the shower and all of the shower thoughts that come with it gave alexis some great ideas they're ready to get creative 
what whether it's back in bed or a different outlet girl not you horny but my sis is tucked away in this air mattress okay she is sleeping away her problems she looks stressed she frowned up she looked just like her sister girl oh lord but she's tossing and turning she going through it she's like i just can't believe i got myself in a situation again kendall made her some breakfast whenever she's ready oh He's taking out the trash. Come on. He already getting a little bit more responsible. Honestly, I feel like a Kendall having a child won't be that bad, y'all. Like, I feel like his place, like, if once he gets, like, a better place. Okay, yes, he got rid of his stuff, too. And he can go to bed as well. Like, go ahead and go to sleep. Y'all go to sleep together. And then when y'all wake up, y'all could go to Alexis's first appointment. But, yeah, I feel like maybe this is what Kendall needs to get his ish together. Both of them uh, bum off their siblings, so, you you know but yeah maybe having a child would be the thing that gets these two to start being more responsible hey everybody going to work i'm not there i am at my man that's not my man house hey daddy is off to work alexis is up she is she gotta pee okay well girl go pee you know where the bathroom is it's like two rooms in this apartment don't pee on yourself so my sis has to pee she feels nauseous she has morning sickness craving healthy food not ready for this sometimes the torturous nature of being pregnant at a time when you don't want children hits you like a train okay girl unwanted child on the way alexis okay i already read that and my sis is um her anemia is acting up well what we can fix out of all of that no alexis is not cheerful y'all take your iron and take your vitamin also y'all look alexis does not have a job she is unemployed okay do you feel better now alexis are you throwing up oh my sis is gonna throw up in this toilet i'm not stopping it girl this pregnancy is already too much like girl oh no wait I know this is gross. I'm taking a picture of this, but I'm sorry. I need y'all. I need to see my Sims pain in 4D. I need to catch it on film. You need to be thinking about the decisions that got you head first in this toilet, in this man's nasty, yucky apartment. But you know what's crazy? She gonna stick beside him, y'all. She is gonna stick beside him. I don't know. Let me see how Alexis feels about him. Let's go over here and look in the profile. First Sim ever kissed. Girl, what the? Really? I didn't know that. Had a child together. Perceived as attractive. Soulmates. Amazing compatibility. But yet you don't know one, two, three, four of his traits. Like what's his career in education? Okay, high school graduate. Cool. Like he don't got no job. You ain't got no job. And y'all got a baby on the way. Girl, y'all need to get y'all lives together. How, take a bath. Ooh, you gonna put your bare booty on this shower? I don't know about that. Take a shower. Oh, she's still, she's still nauseous it's still morning so i'm not surprised child kindle over here cussing in his sleep what's his problem grab a plate your man made you breakfast he wanted to make you feel at home in his home so he made you some breakfast it feels like it's been forever since kindle has been romantic with his partner which one he got a fear of being cheated on kindle can't help but to wonder what his partner's up to or who are they seeing behind his back how you knew i was messing with jamal like did jamal say something like i don't know alexa's about to send jamal a little text just because i like mess this is a little side story we can be as messy as we want to over here let's send him a little text be like you know hey how you doing i just wanted to talk to you why she want to chat with kendall wow do you like kendall over jamal slick look at the meters she's like yeah you know sorry i couldn't uh return your phone call i was asleep in another bed shout forbidden words she just cussing at this point she like why you couldn't use a damn condom again again she's mad he's just like it's gonna be okay they really do look like their brother and sister that's crazy uh kendall who you texting he's probably texting jay like the same thing like sorry i couldn't hit you up last night i was asleep both of y'all got a little boo thing on the side oh look at them both texting they little boo thing so we made it to the obstetrician's office let me just have my sis come over here so what i don't want i don't want to know the gender but i do want to just okay ultrasound preference we're gonna say that my sis is gonna just um let's get Hiroto okay our dad is not here thank god because that's a whole nother thing we don't want to have to tell him no keep it a surprise because realistically she's not that pregnant she's still in her first trimester I'm gonna wait till her
her second trimester so she can see what she is actually having but let me let my sis come over here and get her little ultrasound wait okay you gonna give us our ultrasound or nah like stop acting like that agnes girl when did you become good judy's with agnes uh go ahead agnes get your back cracked i ain't mad anyway um my sis is gonna come down here please don't get naked alexis please alexis has learned okay good where is the baby daddy hello you can't be kc can't did he leave where he at hold on girl he left but uh hello now he's trying to join congratulations you're expecting twins hold up 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 y'all it's me acting fake surprise i knew she was having twins but this for y'all congratulations you're expecting twins the ultrasound scan shows that you have two healthy babies growing inside of you this is a big change but we'll be here to support you every step of the way it's important to take care of yourself and your babies be sure to get enough rest eat a healthy diet and stay hydrated this is an exciting and busy time but with proper care and support you'll be able to have a happy pregnancy and delivery so we having twins y'all we having twins why he trying to join us at the last minute you shouldn't have left you shouldn't have left where you at not you trying to come and run in here hold on let me change your outfit for my thumbnail uh hold on because why you leave is this the other baby is this baby a and baby b child i guess alexis had that abortion and her uterus was like you know i had to double it so hey here's where we are yo why she look content slick she look kind of content or do she look sad no my sis looks sad wait wait kendall looking like girl what the hell going on twins he want to be casey so bad father of two um wait my girl i'm trying to get her face i'm trying to get these pictures y'all she's like what the hell we gonna do now shared sadness okay he's sad but i think my, my sis is okay wait unwanted baby seeing the image of her baby on the ultrasound scan is leaving alexis feeling overwhelmed confused and uncertain about what to do part of her is guilty and ashamed for not wanting children it's important that alexis takes the time to process their emotions and considers all of her options after all her decision will impact her life she must take care of herself and her emotional well-being in order to navigate this difficult decision so sis was like damn it's it's twins it kind of got real mood swing sad from pregnancy the slightest little things are making alexis want to cry hormones are all out of whack probably well yeah my sis just found out she's having twins so not only one unwanted baby but you're having twins my girl like it, it's a lot i'm gonna have her go home and we'll be back child why well, my game so damn messy so i found a ring in omari's bag i think she's gonna propose to me boy if you don't get the f no she's not i don't know what to do what should i say yes no god that's my sister so i'm gonna say yes but like omari is not proposing to you and why is our brother freezing to death what does that say hold on what the hell you're right of course i should say yes what was i thinking omg i can't believe this is happening boy shut the hell up omari is doing no such thing if you found an engage well why is he in the pool well it did say that he was suffering um let me go ahead and get my bookie some some uh go get that psychiatric evaluation yeah go ahead with your dad you know your parents going through a divorce you sitting here flo yes go ahead miss work yeah uh your baby is freezing to death like I don't have time too much is happening this save file is really messy as hell so they're gonna go get a little psychiatric evaluation she is girl she's trying to drink coffee no you're pregnant you can't have caffeine like that miss mamas it's it's a wrap so we're gonna go ahead and call our good sis like i'm gonna call amari we're gonna ask amari can we come over i know we just left but sis i need to run it back i have to tell you something okay yes of course you could come over 
girl you know you live here okay let's go so we made it to Amari house Amari you going inside Amari like girl come on in here w what's the problem Amari met her outside with the bullshit why everybody be meeting my girl outside oh I just want to see dream y'all so this is Alexis's niece dream I wonder if she coming to see us look how cute she is oh my gosh the cutest little new toddler that's why she walking like that she she just got her little toddler legs she don't know how to use them quite yet now she's very sad going to the mirror Amari's like girl what the hell is wrong with you you came to my place Amari already know look how she looking she like I already know it's some bs let's share the pregnancy news with her let's tell our sis that we're pregnant Amari's like girl what the you talking about she's like girl I'm pregnant and it's twins why wow, Amari gagged Amari want to be an auntie so bad wow oh this is so cute actually let me take a little picture of my sis mind you Amari paid for the abortion in the first place oh this is nice you know she's not being a judgy big sister she's actually being very supportive she like you know I, I guess baby god bless you and the babies why oh we see one of my babies in here where my other baby at this is nice oh sister love yo is my dog running away hey yo cookie where the hell you going oh why she crying is she happy happy tears oh they both kind of like effed up she's like i know you're not happy about this and it's twins amari is like damn i know i'm about to have the babysit i know i'm about to have to help with this baby in some way shape or form like i just aged my toddler up and now this bit is coming with these two babies like girl oh not dream coming out being nosy oh now she getting asked on a date wait because why dream really came out here to be nosy dreams like what's going on i hear my auntie um okay we being messy we just found out that we're pregnant by kendall and let's go on a date with jamal i mean he ain't our man yet okay we pulled up to the humor and hijinks festival we not really in the mood um oh she's nauseous i hope he don't know me nauseous india what are you doing here india girl can I just send her home? They got my sister in this stuff. She don't even know India. Oh, she does know India. Okay. They got my sister in this stuff. India, you're not supposed to be out here. Girl, our, our sister baby daddy here slash ex-husband Royce. We cool with Royce though, so we ain't got no smoke. You you leaving your mans though. Hold on. Let's, let's, hopefully Kendall's not here. Let's give him a little amorous hug. Uh, let me check. Oh, I forgot she was messing with Kyle. Like she was supposed to have a little Kyle phase, but I mean, he never made us a cast and got that makeover. So so it is what it is. I'm just trying to check and see if my, my boy is here. Okay, he's not. Samir is here. Samir, what are you doing here? Okay, this is Jalen's husband. Y'all, if y'all know, okay, yeah, go away. What the hell is Samir here? Let's, can we light? Damn, we can't light these? I wanted to light the fireworks. Puka, we can't do nothing here. It ain't even fun. Let's just leave. There's nothing we can do. What's this little punch? Y'all, I don't be going to base game events. Is this liquor? Not join the jokesters. Uh, join the jokesters together? I don't know. He's a tourist? Oh man, that's a good man. India, did not tell your ass to go home. And, and what you get? What you in? I don't dress you like this. Girl, this is why I ain't want to put nobody in from the other safe. I, India, oh, she's not pregnant in this say file who's this man look at don't get your ass beat up because kale don't play that india y'all is this liquor do i got my girl drinking liquor oh now she came over here alexis is messy she came here with one man and talking to the other man girl now he pulled up on us pulled up on us like what's up can we boo this is our, our sister's ex-husband can i boo him he's trying to do a comedy routine you know what's the real joke you as a father that's the real joke royce so yeah oh is she drunk y'all is that okay no it's not it's not liquor right oh my girl gotta pee don't pee on yourself here that's crazy okay who she got a new little sentiment with okay she got a sentiment with jamal what does it say oh she's smitten alexis can't explain it but she's really enamored with jamal and the sight of him makes alexis's heart beat faster but they got bad compatibility and she thinks he's basic looking they're best friends when did that happen deeply connected lovers okay but you and kendall are soulmates so girl i don't know like are you gonna be with kendall or are you gonna be with jamal because like what's it given like oh who was that oh i thought y'all don't don't clown me why i thought that was casey i got my glasses on i don't know what's the problem but yeah um alexis is not pleased girl india just be talking to any old body her nice ass girl 
Just talking to anybody. Pitbull in the corner. She pregnant. Now, y'all, this lady pregnant for real. Y'all can't tell me she not pregnant. She got a perfect uh stomach. What she having? Announce unwanted pregnancy. Like, hey, sis, I see you pregnant. I don't want my baby. Girl, you the only fool over here watching this uh damn circus act. Oh, not India coming over here. I feel like India knows. India knows this is Omari's sister, and I think they know each other. She like slick wanna speak, but she like, I don't know. She like she having she going through something. Not they over here. Not all my safe five people over here. Now he talking to Jalen's man. Okay, my sister back home. I let her take a little bath, but she's about to go to sleep right now. Yeah, girl, I'm trying to send you to bed. If you would just go to bed I'll, i'm trying to send you there but yeah i'm gonna let my sis get a little sleep y'all this has been the first episode of whatever this is at this point but thank you guys for tuning in and i'll see you in the next one bye